How important is bias against age, also called ageism? Very important. Ageism is more frequent and subtle than race and sex bias, according to the Commissioner for Human Rights. And in a recent survey by SBS, more than half of younger people said the biggest benefit for older Australians is to pass on their resources. Added to that is the isolation of the aged and lack of adult communication with loved ones, perhaps leading to mental illness. My vision is to reverse this trend. I'm Alfred Zerfus, a retired epidemiologist. I'm aged, ah, and lonely, my family being overseas. But singing makes me happy. And knowing the beneficial effects of music, I wanted to share this with others in a similar situation. So I started Sing with Fred. So the solution is to have loved ones to sing to and perhaps with their isolated elder with care and gratitude. So I'm going to include music therapists, musicians, doctors, aged care and nursing homes, stakeholders in this process. I've already done three Zooms with friends and relatives, and I've got some positive feedback. The plan is to reach elders through aged care homes and support groups. Their loved ones would be invited to the first online session to prepare and sing or play the selected tune. Later sessions, with a modest subscription of $25 to $50 monthly, have regular connections using stakeholders. This may include coaching to promote a positive mindset about the value of elders. I'm exploring an app to record and store happy memories stimulated by song and music called Happiness with IT research centers. The impact includes the numbers who connect with their loved ones with positive feedback and the number of collaborating institutions. In the long term, pre and post tests on elders, including memory, by using interviews and surveys. Here's a matrix that arranges goals and milestones. On the left, in white background, are the goals. Long term, start up and stretch. The stretch goal may be a unique app with great potential. The milestones for each goal are coloured to show status. Week 4 was a major advance to identify the customer for targeting thanks to excellent activator support and help continuous in other goals. I'm starting and I have a way to go, but patient and passionate for the journey. Your funds would support my business to hire a virtual assistant at 10 hours a week, also consultants to prepare a grant proposal. I envisage a small but unique contribution for elders and mental health. Thank you.